Thank you. Um, good afternoon, everyone. My name is Jim Benjamin, and uh, Chris is absolutely right. Uh, it could be either one of those, but they actually coined us um, Pizza Robot. So I'm going to talk about um, our product. Let me introduce it to you. So let's dive right into the machine. Um, there's um, uh, the freezer compartment where the dough is, and then we have the um, uh, ingredients compartment where it's fresh ingredients, um, pepperoni sauce, um, and cheese. And then there's a uh, press that par bakes uh, the pizza at 250 degrees, and then it moves off to an oven that cooks it at 700 degrees and then puts it into a box. So some facts about the machine. Uh, standard uh, commercial power, 220, uh, 60 amps. Uh, takes uh, three and a half minutes to make the first pizza, 90 seconds for the second. It's an eight inch pie um, that then um, gets uh, shipped into the box, as I mentioned. Uh, 150 uh, pizzas is a full load. Um, we've worked with uh, partners, uh, best in, in channel partners, um, Calvary Robotics for engineering and manufacturing, and Rich's Foods for um, uh, dough manufacturing and distribution. So our value proposition, 24-7 um, great tasting pizza from fresh ingredients. Um, that's for the consumer. For the operator, our value proposition to them is to reduce cost of infrastructure, we heard a little bit about that earlier today, and labor, an exceptional one-year ROI. Uh, our story, um, the company was started in 2005 by Puzan Kachadorian, uh, the machine inventor, and a group of small investors. Um, uh, extensive uh, consumer research was done, and a group of very talented industry engineers went off and um, created this process uh, perfection. Uh, over $14 million was spent in rigorous uh, design and, and tests. Phase one is done, and we're actually um, uh, ready for phase two. In phase one, we built five machines, uh, and, and actually uh, no component failure for 20,000 pizzas. Totally patented, you heard that. Patents are important, UL certified and designed for NSF. Um, here's our last um, uh, market trial at the University of Rochester. Phenomenal um, uh, trial we had, and 20% um, of the daily sales were achieved with that location. Students um, often said it's convenient, it's fast, uh, very good pizza, no more stranded stomachs um, uh, studying late. Um, in terms of uh, operator ROI, uh, what's the ideal uh, um, location had some attributes? Um, high volume, uh, asynchronous traffic, um, 500 plus people. Um, you could average price the pizza at $6. Um, and as you could see, um, really ideal location like an airport, uh, travel plaza, entertainment uh, venues. As you can see there, the um, revenue is um, good and uh, the profit is good, uh, actually exceptional, regardless of if you, you um, purchase or uh, lease the equipment. What's next for us? Um, build 30 uh, production machines and get them into the uh, marketplace uh, placements. Um, and I have some good news for you. Um, we will have two machines here in uh, Seattle um, coming soon at the GM nameplate, which is about five minutes away from here. So our market is very focused. Uh, on-demand, 24-7 uh, pizza service for the consumer. Smart kitchen pizza robot. Thanks, and stop by our um, booth today, and we'll show you a video, and we could dive into um, any details that you have. Thank you. you can